My fellow Vedzi Abbey is a skilled complimenter. They blew us away last year with their six-word stories, and in the comments of their latest response video, Caleb said, Gosh darn it, Abby, how are you so good at complimenting people? Each thing you say is so thoughtful and totally unique from anything you've said before. I need to learn how to do this. Well, Caleb, let's break it down together. Today, I'm going to look at the way Abby compliments people, try to figure out why those remarks resonate with us, and hopefully teach you and myself how to be better at making other people feel good. Number one. Pay attention. Like a good joke, a good compliment comes from keen observation, and the more specific you can be, the more satisfying the payoff. I think that the greatest compliments make us feel not just seen, but understood. So for example, Abby's six-word story about Graham was youthful historian, play me a story, which I think captures Graham's exuberance, his enthusiasm for history, and his musicianship. Abby is able to capture so much of his identity in just those few words because they've taken the time to watch what he puts out and to observe who he is as a human being. Number two, say what you feel. The point of a compliment is not to say what you think the other person wants to hear or to say what you think will advance your relationship with them. That can come across as insincere. Your aim should be to express the impact the other person had on you. So I guess this step is really know what you feel and say what you feel. This can be really simple. I recently reflected on some of my favorite VEDS videos of past years, and Abby commented that they felt deeply inspired and seen by my Bad Habits video, and that it actually inspired them to think about doing VEDS for themselves. That's impact. Number three, go with what you know. I think a struggle that a lot of us have with compliments is that we don't have the words to convey how we feel. So we fall back on generic phrases that sound nice, but aren't unique to us or the person we're talking about. Metaphor can be a great way of conveying feeling, but sometimes metaphors feel like a reach. We think they have to sound poetic. They don't. A metaphor is a comparison, so use what you know. Abby's Day 22 video, Your Videos Remind Me Of, does this beautifully. It's such a simple prompt, but it elicits these instantly understandable comparisons. For example, Caleb as a professor who's knowledgeable about their subject, but not afraid to go off on a tangent, or Tessa's videos, like holding hands with someone and having them put their other hand on top. So if you pay attention, say what you feel, and go with what you know when crafting a compliment, you end up with a message that is specific, genuine, and which feels personal. Abby, we are so moved by your compliments because you see in us things that we might think of as ordinary, unremarkable, or even flawed, and you hold them up as worthy of appreciation. You call us wizards. But the piece of magic that you most remind me of are those stones with the hole in the center, hagstones. In folklore, hagstones have many uses, but my favorite is that by holding them up to your eye and looking through them, you can see through disguises or see into the fairy realm. And I think that's your great gift, to see things that others can't see, to see the truth of a thing. Hagstones are also used for protection and for warding off negative forces. And if any of us ever need to ward off feelings of insecurity or inadequacy, we can just go watch your videos. We have just over a week left in September, so I hope all of you can use what we learned today to leave some beautiful compliments in the comments of the Vedzies videos. And with that, my fellow friends and Vedzies, you beautiful humans, I will see all of you tomorrow. We'll be grand! If the camera just stays focused, to be grande. Eh? All right. Oh, I would really like this to stay focused. Do you think that do we think that the camera will stay focused now? If not, it'll be a short video. <laughs>